here we are down in the cabin of this 2004 215 Weekender. You can see you have a uh, vacuum flush uh, Santa potty. Little compartment there. As we pan around here, you've got storage up along the side in your V berth. As we come back here a little bit, you can see the V berth. You've got a little area for a table set up down here get out of the sun and you've got your port lights and you have your hatch there which you can pull this the screen is set up in it uh, pop the hatch up and get some nice cool air down here you also have over here on the port side you have your sink fresh water as well as you have your stereo down in the cabin um, to make it uh, easy and convenient uh, to put CDs in and run it from the controls up at the helm. Uh, this way it keeps it out of the elements and keeps it uh, nice and dry. You also have storage. One of the storage compartments is in the little step here. As you walk up to the cabin, you also have storage under each of the seats. Now we'll go ahead and take a look in the uh, cockpit. Here you can see the 5.0 MPI fuel injected Mercury's or engine. See the engine compartment is nice and clean, been well maintained, and uh, you get your dual batteries down there as well. Um, it's going to have plenty of power to, to run this boat and uh, get you up on plane quick. As we look here in the cockpit, you can see you've got the option to have the long bench seat all the way across the motor cover. You have the helm seat with the flip up thigh rise bolster makes it uh, convenient to drive either standing up or in the seated position when you flip it down nice and easy nice heavy duty uh, seat right there and you can see your uh, clarion remote panel for the stereo you get trim tabs your nice wood grain dash and then all of your other switches uh, horn water system lights navigation lights bilge pump bilge blower all that down on the right as we zoom in here you can see we're rated for eight people 1400 pounds 1800 pounds with gear and people still have the thigh rise seat on the the uh, co-captain's chair you can see storage up along the side make it uh nice and easy to throw things so you don't have to have everything down in the cabin and then you also have the option for the table um, stand right there as well we'll go ahead and take a look at the outside of the boat take a look at this 2004 225 weekender from the exterior you can see the gel coats in great shape it does have bottom paint as we look into the rear transom of the boat you can see a nice large double swim platform the initial one attached to the boat uh, the second one comes out over the uh, lower unit stainless steel bravo 3 out drive the counter rotating props gets this boat up on plane nice and quick makes it very efficient um, and uh, increases your top end speed as well so you have your trim tabs get yourself set up for a nice easy ride comfortable ride regardless of uh, how you have everybody situated in the boat you have the transom trailer switch on the left so you can put your motor up and down from the uh, outside of the boat and then you also have a transom stereo control uh, so if you're in the water hanging out on the back of the boat you can adjust the stereo volume uh, station setting uh, skip forward on a CD as well um, without going back up into the cabin and you also, this is a nice feature, you have a transom washdown. You can see that little shower head uh, nozzle right there. Put the uh, water pump on. You can wash your feet off, wash the back of the boat off, um, spray the dog down. Uh, makes it nice and convenient when you're uh, beached up or when you're just getting in the boat for the first time or getting out of it as well, putting on your shoes and socks. Um, as we look from the rear, you can see the double bimini tops, which is going to cover almost the entire cockpit area. Uh, allows you to be in the shade the entire time when you're out on your boat or you can fold them up and uh, get all the sun that you would like 
as we come down here on the port side again you can see gel coats in great condition all the way down you have nice sturdy heavy-duty cleats just a good looking boat on this 225 weekender come over here hopefully the sun's not glaring too much here take a look at this boat from the profile again the trailer comes with this boat it is an aluminum I-beam trailer dual axle brakes um, but just a great boat family boat the people that have these uh, just love them being able to to um, get down in that cabin get up out of the Sun and uh, makes it a very versatile boat uh, for all seasons uh, you also have the snap-on canvas covers for the cockpit and uh, so you can keep your boat looking great inside like it already does uh, give me a call for more information on this boat number here is 803-831-2101 my extension is 630 again this is Matt Sellhorse Lake Wiley Marina thank you very much